tingling down your arm and chest, peg. He's gone in. Pull yourself out! Pull yourself out! Come on! Pull some effort in! Don't stay in there all day! Drop the pool! Oh, Hands above your head! Hands above your head! Hands above your head! Okay, roll in the snow! Roll in the snow! Roll in the snow! Roll the snow, Jamie! That'll make you much better rather than a big pink fluffy towel. What? This vault's stuck to my lips. Oh, Christ. More vault stuff than that. Oh, God. Well, hurry up. Put some coffee in your mouth. Oh, hurry up. No, this hurts, man. Mm. Oh, God. Oh. That's hot. Put it in there. Put it in there. <sighs> Shove your face in it. Oh, thank yeah. God for that. Bloody hell. However, the boffins were now starting to get worried about my falling skin temperature. Oh, how's your nose getting on? All your tackle OK? Still intact? Are you cold? No. What if we just stopped and camped? Camping here at minus 50. Oh, for God's sake. It's going dark. Very soon, I won't be able to see at all. The pillow was just a pillowcase soaked in glacial water and then filled with stones. <sighs> my sleeping bag broke. My blanket was see-through. My body was down to a temperature Hitherto unknown to science, I would have come and bludgeoned you to death last night. But you're not moaning about it, so that's OK. James doesn't look very happy. What's up with him? He's oh, a bit free. Do you want the heater on? <laughs> Shut up. Put the heater on and see if it makes any difference. I'll put it on Oh, more. that's better. <laughs> Thanks. Now, though, it was time for the tricky bit. Imagine you have. Building our roof. But... OK, I'm going to operate the heater controls now. Land Rover heaters are, you know, not, not their best feature, if I'm honest. That's on full. I can't feel it at all. This is my... These are my night clothes that I like to wear. Oh, there we go. You could have used warm water. It's freezing. Oh, there's 30-odd years' worth of bag ends and fluff coming up on top. Look at it going up the window. It's fantastic. <laughs> Finally, Hammond and I arrived at the reservoir. Now, while we're waiting for James, I should explain it's March. It's the coldest March for 20 years because of global warming. And that means the water into which we shall be driving is... Well, how, how would you...? I'll tell you. <laughs> Leave it! The windscreen is heated, but not bulletproof. Stand by the beach! Are you cold? No, I haven't. James, does it get hotter or colder when you're at altitude? I've forgotten. I'm pretty sure it gets much hotter. No, no, hang on, sorry. Colder. Well, there's only one way we can accurately determine what temperature it is, and that's by talking to our colleague. I know what you're thinking, I'm fine. <laughs> that rain makes a really annoying noise on my calendar helmet. And it comes through. There is, of course, one tiny drawback to the combine as a snowplow. Because it was designed to work in August, it has no heater. No. Which is why there's a drum in there you can probably see through the window. Uh, and that's, well, it's, a, it's an urn. We've put that in there full of, well, we wanted tea. But James said, I want Bovril. Because he's in 1950. We all know that when it's snowing and it's cold, you have Bovril. That's a rule of life. Oh, this has got very Scottish. Oh, it's, it's really it's cold. Scottish. Really cold now. Having established he'd been doing a polar bear friendly eight miles to the gallon, James announced it was time for his morning ablutions, which meant he had to put his car in the car park. Let's sing a song. No. Have you seen... Have you seen how cold it is? 
I can't see how cold it is, but no, I but can I, I feel it. No, but I actually just looked. In the... Drizzle 6 feels like 2. Well, you know what would warm you up? What? A bicycle ride. It always does. I'm just trying to do it my shirt sleeves, because it's quite chilly and that will make a difference. Definitely getting colder. Fortunately, the 3.4 litre straight 6 generates so much heat and there is so little shielding that whilst my top half is cold, my bottom half is toasty warm. The next morning, it was cold outside, so we needed warm clothes for our trip up the mountains. James therefore went shopping Jag style, and I didn't. Ah, welcome to the hotel, sir. I could take your your coat. Thank you very Comes. much. Had a pleasant trip? Yes, yes, Lovely. thank you. Your hat? Oh, well, thank you. That's your bag as well, sir. Thank you very much. If you'd like to go and see my colleague on reception, that would be marvellous. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you. Both of us were stuck, but luckily we had the right equipment for such a cold weather emergency. The beaver we ate last night, we made some clothes out of its out of its fur, and that's gonna be handy now. Beaver mittens. <laughs> 